हेलो स्टूडेंट्स राइट नाउ वी आर हेयर विद अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक टुडे प्रीवियसली वी डेड हाउ टू प्रीवियसली वी लर्न हाउ टू फैटराइज द क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन एंड राइट नाउ वी विल स्टार्ट क्वाड्रेटिक इन इक्वालिटीज ऑफ स्केचिंग इन दिस टॉपिक यू हैव टू नो दैट इफ द एक्स स्क्वायर कोफिशेंट इज पॉजिटिव कर्व इज लाइक यू शेप एंड इफ द एक्स स्क्वायर कोफिशेंट इज नेगेटिव इट मीन्स हेयर इफ द एक्स स्क्वायर इज पॉजिटिव see this equation if the x square is positive the curve will be like this u shape and if x square is negative yani it means if it is, if it is a negative sign then it is a u inverted shape okay so right now in order to factorize this equation uh, we need to choose such two numbers that if we multiply it become minus 4 and if we add or subtract it become minus 3 so we will break minus 3 we will break minus 3 Into minus four and plus one, so minus three we break into minus four and plus one. Uh, we have two brackets. Take x common from this first two, uh, two terms. X plus x plus one and x minus four are the two brackets. Okay. Okay. so this we will read this bracket as we want those values of x it means that we need those values of x where curve or y values are equal to zero because here we have two sign equality as well as greater so y values are equal to zero or greater than zero so first just just sketch this curve we have one value of x minus 1 and the second is 4 minus when you minus 1 value on this side plus 4 value on this side this is the curve this will be the curve because it is a u shape x square is positive right now we need in this graph we need such value of y or the curve whenever we say the curve it means the curve or the y values y values are these okay y values are these so right now if i just stand on minus 1 if i just stand on minus 1 here uh, on x axis always the y is zero okay and if you go towards the left on minus 1 these values are Where the y are positive, y are positive, y equal to zero, and if you go on the left, the y are positive. It means I need these values of y, okay? Uh, it means I need these values of x. Sorry, these values of x. It means, okay? Uh, it means I need these values of x. Sorry, these values of x. It means if I move on the left of minus one, minus one, I will get positive y values. Similarly. If I stand on plus four, if I stand on x equal to plus four, I stand on plus four. If I stand on x equal to plus four, here y is zero because always on x axis y is zero. And if I go on the right hand side of plus four, here you see the shaded part. You see the curve is going above the y axis, or it is uh, where the y values are plus on on the positive side. It is always positive. So uh, the answer will be if I stand on if I stand on it means equal to. i stand on minus 1 or less than minus 1 it means equal to or less than minus 1 the y values are positive similarly if i stand on 4 it means equal to 4 and if i move on the right of plus 4 it means greater than 4 if i move on the right so x greater than equal to 4 here uh, in the bracket i have i summarized this just observe these values of y at these values of y uh, y is equal to 0 or greater than 0 uh, it means if you stand on x equal less than equal to minus 1 or x greater than equal to 4 you will see the y value is equal to 0 or greater than 0 hello assalamualaikum dear students again uh, we are doing the very interesting topic of quadratic equations that is curve sketching we are here with the second example Uh, right now you see that the question giving question is 6 plus x minus x square greater than 0 so the very a very simple step is to first make the coefficient of x square positive in order to make this uh, x square coefficient positive we will just take the negative sign common we have now x x square positive plus x becomes negative And six is minus x. The inequality, like greater than or equal to zero, remains same. Uh, right now, we need to remove minus sign, negative sign. Okay. So just if I multiply by the negative sign, uh, 
you know that whenever we multiply negative sign inequality sign changes inequality sign changes so greater than 0 becomes less than 0 right now with the same method of factorization here we get two brackets uh, we need such two numbers where if you multiply it becomes minus 6 and if we plus or minus it becomes minus 1 okay so we have uh, two brackets minus 3 and plus 2 right now you see that these two brackets are less than 0 we will read these two bracket as read this bracket as we want those values of x here uh, right now you see that x one value of x is 3 and the second value of x is minus 2 but right now using these values of x you need to observe that uh, at what time around these values of x the curve or y values are only less than 0 here right now you see that there is no inequality sign there is no equality sign okay it is right now you see that the graph will be like this because right now x square coefficient is positive okay so we have made the coefficient of x square positive so the graph will be like u shape okay so we have two values of x minus 2 on this side left hand side 3 on right hand side okay plus 3 on right hand side the curve will be like this passing with these roots or the values of x right now you see that we need such values where y is less than 0 okay so if you go from minus 2 if you go on minus 2 the curve is equal to 0 if you go on the left of minus 2 it is greater than 0 but if you move on the right side if you move on the right side okay so these uh, shaded part you see that right now here the uh, uh, the values of y are y is less than 0 these shaded part okay because you are going on the negative side again it is uh, less than 0 till 3 because just before 3 it is less than 0 y is less than 0 but, but just when you stand at 3 just when you reach 3 it becomes 0 so therefore uh, value of 3 is not included and value of minus 2 is not included minus 2 just the, all the values before my, minus 2 before minus 2 after, after minus 2 sorry the, 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 all the values